So let's go back into this audio editor for iPad called Twisted Wave and go on to the second part of what we can do with the app. So let's see what else we can do. Let's take this bit here and go to this section here and I can add a Dynamics processor to it. Lots of different things you can do with this here and you'll have to just check it out and see what these various uh, things do with the threshold, ratio and stuff like that. It's going to um, change the sound of your audio. We've got a normalize in there. So we've got a normalization level of plus 0 dB. So let's click on apply and that will change that sound as well. Also, if I haven't got something selected, then what I can do is I can go to this one here, click on normalize, and now the normalization will apply to all of it. So let's click on apply, and as you can see, it's done the work on the whole of that audio. So there's a couple of good things about this application I really like, and when I've done that, I can send it off to iTunes. I can do an FTP upload to um, various places, but I have to configure an account first. Now this is quite good, I can actually send it off to SoundCloud. Obviously you do need to have a SoundCloud account first. If you could help me out by going to the share button and sharing out to one of the places, you could share it out to Facebook for instance. Just click on a button there and something comes up and you just got to click on the share. You can say something or not, it's up to you. And if you want to share it to more places, just click on that there and you've got a few different choices there. You can even share it out to Pinterest. Don't forget to click on the like button. Thanks a lot. Cool, I like that. It means that I can just go into this one here. I can say that I wanted to go into Foursquare, I wanted to go into Twitter, and I can send it off to my Facebook account at the same time, at the same time as sending it off to SoundCloud. And you can do other things such as adding an image on there. So let's just um, choose something from the photo roll. And that's something I did in one of my art applications there. And I can scale it, move it, click on use. And I can put a note in there and change the name of it so if I want to. I can even send it off to Tumblr if I want to as well. So that gives you a number of possibilities for sending and sharing your audios out from Twisted Wave via SoundCloud. And also what I can do is I can tell it to open in. So for instance, I might want to send it off as a note into Evernote. And I could send it to another of my audio recorders such as a Recorder or Open in iRig recorder so any of those ones there or open in smart record I can even send it into iMovie so that's quite good as well isn't it I can also send it to Downcast the podcast app that I use on my iPad and I really like the way that you've got some good positioning tools so for instance I want to position the cursor there it tells me that it's six seconds and nine eight seven across there and then what I can do is I can select that there for instance and it tells me that the length of the Audio selected is 9 seconds and 104. Go back into my documents. You can see now that I've got this uh, document in here. I can tap on that there and it takes me back into the document. I can select that there. I can do sharing from this here too. Um, browser access. So if I do that, now I can go into the Mac, open up the browser. So I can go in there and I can send that file across to something else. I can do an import. I can go into the iTunes file sharing or to the iPod library. And let's go into this one here. And most times you're not really going to need to touch this one here, but uh, it's possible. You can put 32-bit uh, temporary files, but the files are going to be big and I don't have a large storage space on this iPad, so I'm going to leave that off. So there you go. I think this is an absolutely marvellous application and well worth getting if you like to be able to see your waveforms when you're editing your audio. So this is Dave Allen for No Stylus. Bye bye now. Talk to you again soon. Thanks for watching the video and why don't you check out the other videos. Here's two of them. There's one video there and one video there that you can click on and go and have a look at now. And don't forget that you can also subscribe. Talk to you again soon. Bye bye now.